Hello, my villain, and welcome back to another episode of King's Quest. Let's explore some more, shall we? I want to explore it all up before I go to the shop where the saw blade thing is. Oh, it's just back here. Okay, cool. So I only have two more routes to go before I go back to the town. It's this way. This looks safe. Well, uh, let's go. Guess I'm not going that way then. Oh, oh no. Told you it's not polite to go stomping around on people's backs. Give Tiny me one reason. good reason not to gobble you up right now. You'd better let me go. I've slain many monsters in my day. Oh, how annoying for them. Anyone I know. Well, uh, too many to count, really. Uh, have you heard of the ravenous Yeti of Serenia? The skulking crystal dragon of Eldritch, all slain by me, single-handedly. Oh, you mean Bill and Susan? We had tea together last week. <clears throat> now are you sure you wish to threaten me? Yes, give me your eye, or else. Are you really, really sure? I bet you weren't expecting this. <laughs> Your sting is pretty weak. Are you sure you're not a honeybee? I am most certainly not a honeybee. Uh-huh. That's exactly what a honeybee would say. Lucky for you, Ophie hates the taste of bees. Stingers hurt Ophie's throat. Now, what do you want from me, honeybee? You wouldn't happen to know where I can find an eye of a beast, would you? Is it time for the tournament already? I thought that was on Tuesday. Oh, bother. My memory's failing again. Alfie's been suffering from sleep deprivation. <laughs> a very rude monster has been snarling in the bushes behind my back. Is this monster you speak of hideous, perchance? Snarling Snarlax is legendarily hideous. Those puny guards of Daventry would surely be impressed by his eye. Okay. It is rumored the beast has two purple eyes with bright blue glowing pupils, six legs, three claws, and one tooth. I could let you cross and perhaps even help you with that fire-eyed monster, but since Ulfie didn't eat you, Ulfie needs a pick-me-up. This big tooth is a sweet one. If you bring me something to eat, I'll consider helping you. Hmm. What are all those weird instruments around the bridges for? Usually those horns are used to summon its associated bridge troll to fill the oh. gap. But we have removed all mouthpieces until we get word from the head of the guild. Ulfi was instructed to keep all his horns hidden from humans. <laughs> I keep mine under my butt. Shh. Ugh. Can you share with me why all the bridges seem to be missing in Daventry? Well, little honeybee, until further notice, the Bridge Troll Guild is officially on strike. For too long have we, the bridges, have been stomped on by sharp-pointed shoes of the puny guards. And do they care that my back breaks out in an itchy rash from all that marching? Of course not! As Pilar says, for shame, Daventry. <laughs> We're not going back to work until the kingdom can take better care of their roads. I should be at the meeting, but Ophie always shows up fashionably late, <laughs> right when the croissants are served. Happy trails. Buzz back quickly, honeybee. Ophie is starving. All right. That's interesting. That's an interesting development. 
So I'm not going back to the dragons. Oh. Right. I was going this way. I think I know what I need to get. I need to get that pumpkin, but there's... The problem is the squirrels. Maybe I can do something with a bell to scare the squirrels? Hmm. I better stand on this side of the rock. <laughs> it wouldn't budge. Okay. Let's see what we have here. Oh. Ha, what a peculiar trap. I have a bad feeling if I take this, I'm gonna fall. Yeah, I'm gonna fall. Can I use the bells? No? Okay. Hmm. Interesting. Let's go this way. Fantastical floating island, only st steps away. It's so floatly, floaty. Fantastical old floating oh. island, only steps away. It's so floaty. You'll be amazed. <laughs> okay. Let's go right. Starberries framed a serene view. Shame about that buzzing beehive, though. This is a bad idea. This is bees! a really bad idea. What? I ruined the bees' day and <laughs> that lovely meal. I should have taken... Uh... I tucked the berries away for later, even though I was craving a cliffside snack. I should... Oh, oh, I did a mistake. I should have read the note first. Oh, well, doesn't matter. See, so, yeah, let's go up here. See what's up here. This was on my bucket list. Yes, a floating island <laughs> being suspended by wooden pillars. <laughs> oh dear, deary me. Right, I'm gonna. I'm, I'm guessing the star fruit is up. Uh, this, the fruit is up for the ogre. Not the ogre troll. Sorry. What do we have up here? Then? No? What is this? What is this? I wasn't always the master archer you see before you now. How'd you learn? <laughs> we'll get to that part. Oh, wait. oh okay, I can't shoot. Them. Is that unicorn eating meat? Okay then. Oh, hello. I Don't so. worry. The Wedzels will be here soon, Princess Madeline. How is he up to? You just pranced into a dark <laughs> cave filled with vicious wolves? You know, I'm not sure. Maybe I should pause for reflection. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> oh no. All right. Um, let's go and give the fruits to the troll to see what happens. So he's trying to capture something with those things. Those are sweet, but only when cooked. I need to cook them, eh? Well, let's go back to the pumpkin then. See if I can get it. 
Oh, I went the wrong way. I th yeah, I did. Oh, well, doesn't matter. I can go this way. This way works fine. It's a little bit longer, that's all. I never nope. waste. That didn't need a bell. And this bow cost him such a yeah. Hmm. That pumpkin was housing too many squirrels for my taste. He's still picking fruit, I assume. Okay, let's go into the town. See what we can cook up. I walked into town with my last coin. Whatever path I chose to pursue for my eye would need to be cheap. Um, what about in here? That's my dog drinking in the background, if you wonder. Hey, Graham. If you like sharp things, you've come to the right place. We have over 23. Oh, forgive me. Last night was a little rough. I woke up on the floor. My bed nowhere to be found. Can you believe that? What type of Yahoo steals a bed while you're sleeping in it? <laughs> and the most curious part, nothing else is missing. Anyway, take a look around. Let me know if something piques your interest. Back away from the crumbler. Unless you have 50 gold coins for a work order. Don't touch that, Graham, or you might be the one losing an eye. <laughs> uh, you can post a work order on anything you want lifted, chopped, or crumbled. Then I'll bring out Mrs. Crumbler to fulfill the order. Oh, okay, cool. That's a dagger. Right? How much for that twisty dagger over there? It's not for sale. Needs a bit more work. Well, you don't seem to be selling anything. So, you know what you want? Mm, oh. So, I've been meaning to ask. What is that amazing blade for? Is it for battling vicious werebears? How many ice orcs has it slain? Does it deal justice? Is it road legal? Is it made of fear? <laughs> oh, that? No, no, that's for gardening. I use it to trim my hedges. Seeing as my place is all tended to, and my petunias are most lovely, I'm willing to part with it for the price of one shiny gold coin. I'm sure you've got a prickly situation that needs attending. Ooh. Bye. Hey, kid, can you do me a favor? I can try. Can you help me keep that back door closed? I run the local Wedzel Wolf Watch program here in town. There's patches getting made. If you keep that door closed, you can be an official member. Think it over. Patches! How many gold coins do I have? It's only money to my name. Okay, I only have one coin, so I can buy that. Let's go let's go with other options just to see what I can get. So that would get hmm. That would probably get rid of the roots. Oh, oh, coming! Sorry for all the locks. There's a thief running around town. What can you offer me? Well, hello there. Usually I'd say good afternoon, but it's been quite rough around here. The bridges are all out, my supplier has gone missing, and when I was at the parade, someone stole my big loaf of bread. Oh, uh, uh, you haven't seen anyone running around with a big piece of sourdough, have you? No. I kind of want to... Oh, well, um, about that, uh, I kind of, sort of, borrowed it. A, a man was stranded and needed help. No one seemed to be around to pay. I didn't know what to do. I'm sorry. Well, you can always leave a tip on the counter. That does make me feel better, though. Honesty is a virtue I admire. I'm just glad I don't have to lock the door anymore. Tell you what, buy a pie from me. And we'll be square as a napkin. I'll buy a pie at another time because I need.
I need to get more gold first. If that's a possibility, even. I don't know if it is. This one had five gold, so I and then gave. Oh, you guys look creepy. <sighs> you aren't the delivery boy, are you? That merchant is usually so prompt with our air, miraculous, and oftentimes delicious ingredients. Oh, oh horse feathers, Chester. This boy is no courier. He desires a position in King Edward's court. He seems to be a bold soul, primed to take devotry head on. However, he is one who needs to think a little more before he acts if he's going to defeat the contenders in this year's night tournament. Zounds! Did you just read my fortune? No, we're just very old and very judgmental people. <laughs> it's true, we're judges. This is my judging face. Ariel and I don't read fortunes anymore. Yep, there was no future in it. Well, we've shifted oh. our core business to potions, curiosities, and the occasional practical joke. <laughs> Uh, we gladly share our wisdom for free, but everything else starts at one shiny gold coin. Take a look around, boy. Let us know if you like anything you see. Can I use this? Something mysterious and magical was brewing in that pot. I should probably ask first before I go dipping things in there. Muriel won't let me eat those. Hey, find everything you were looking for? So, I've just gotta know, what is brewing in that cauldron? Is it a transfiguration elixir? Is it an invincibility potion? If I drink it, will I understand the language of creatures? Will I sprout the wings of an eagle? Or a fly? Oh, this? Teeth whitening potion. Oh, it's gonna change everything. Watch this. Behold the power of whitening. Oh well, oh well. Oh well, we'll still work it out the kinks. While we're still in the prototype phase, feel free to dip whatever you want in there free of charge. Yes. Free of charge. Yes, yes, yes. Fare yes, thee yes. well. May your brain be filled with knowledge. Go ahead, dip it! Astounding! That is now cooked, so I can give it to the troll. I'm gonna go and buy that gardening tool, axe, majig, I don't know what the fuck it was. <laughs> and go to that well, see if the dragon is there. So let's see here. Hey, Graham! Oh. Don't touch that, Graham, oh, or on. you might be the one losing an eye. I want to buy it. Oh. <laughs> Don't touch that, Graham, or you might be the one losing an eye. Uh, so, you know what you want? Yes. How much for that gardening tool? One shiny gold coin. Bye. Make your move. Uh. Did you do it? Did you spend your only gold coin on the epic weed whacker? Yes, yes I did. I did. The bold costs a fortune. Now, Graham, promise me you will only use this for its intended purpose. I yes. shall be brave in all my hedge trimmings. Those plants will never see it coming. Awesome. Right, I'm gonna go back to that well. I thought I was gonna need the work order thing, but I think I can actually do it like this. I have a feeling that well is the well of the dragon, but I'm, I'm not so sure anymore. I might have just wasted my last coin. Keep that one closed. Let's see, let's see. Da 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 da. Ta da I am. <laughs> right. Is this the well that we need to go to? Is it a different well? Who knows? 
You'll have to find out in the next episode though because I'm actually all out of time. In the meanwhile, thanks so much for watching, I hope you and I'll see you guys later. Bye. Oh man, that was funny.